as this process is time bound by the Constitution to be concluded in not more than 10 days, pursuant to Article 145 as read together with Article 150 of the Constitution, and noting that the period provided for ends on Saturday, the 19th of October 2024, the only window open to the Senate if it so obliged the request for adjournment sought by counsel for the Deputy President will be to gazette Saturday the 19th of October 2024 as a further and final day for hearing of this matter. Now, honorable senators, ladies and gentlemen, such a request is not made to the speaker, but to the Senate, and is accordingly a matter for the Senate to determine. To facilitate this decision, I direct the clerk of the Senate to circulate a supplementary order paper incorporating a notice of motion and a motion for adjournment sort. This being a procedural matter, the motion, if carried, will result in the speaker gazetting Saturday the 19th of October 2024 as a sitting day to conclude the hearing and determination of this matter. This being the last day allowed by the Constitution of Kenya for these proceedings to conclude. Needless to say, if the motion is not carried, the decision of the Senate will be that this hearing continues to conclusion in the matter, in the matter, in the manner provided for under Rule 12. In such event, the hearing will continue as set out in the program, with the parties moving to make their closing statements. Now, honorable senators, ladies and gentlemen, in conclusion, let me take this opportunity on my own behalf and on behalf of the Senate to convey our sincere sympathies and best wishes for a quick recovery to His Excellency Rigathi Gashagwa EGH, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya.